We're going to talk tonight about being gay in Ireland. What then is a homosexual? A homosexual is a human being like anybody else. You are looking at a screaming lesbian. I'm everywhere. In your armies. In your schools. Peering at you out of passing trains. Yes, I'm here to stay. Homosexuality is something that is based on mutuality. Just the same as heterosexuality where a boy meets girl. Joni is a lesbian and she wants to talk to us about being a lesbian. In Ireland, homosexual men face sentences of from 10 years to life on conviction. Ireland is a difficult place to, to, to be gay in. If you see two men walking down the street holding hands, people are offended. People fear homosexuals. I don't know why they fear them. They're normal people. We have seldom, in our 23 years of The Late Late Show, experienced a barrage of complaint and criticism about this next item as we have experienced this week. I want equality. I want to be allowed to be treated the same as any other woman. Outside Leinster House, members of the gay community were celebrating the acceptance by the Doyle of the bill to decriminalise homosexuality. The fabric of society is disintegrating. Why must we make this so public? I cannot understand Listen, why... Yes, but, but, but we're all living our lives like that. Why must we shouted from the rooftops. I do find the physical act absolutely revolting in the extreme. If you kiss me, it would really get his goat. Dad, there's something I've been meaning to tell you about David and me. Slowly but surely, I started to realise why I was different. I might be gay. I'm queer. I'm a puff. I'm a puffer. I'm a punce. This is truly wonderful news. I think I love you. The Catholic Church provoked an angry response with its renewed opposition to gay marriage. Marriage is an institution exclusively for a man and woman. But today brought a new milestone for this community with the publication of the long-awaited civil partnership bill. We've been waiting for this moment for, well, 29 years, quite a long time. That civil partnership does not go far enough. We will keep marching until equality is achieved. <laughs> You love your child when you give birth to them. You don't change just because you find out they're gay. I'm not ashamed if that's what you think. Really? It doesn't matter whether people think we're a family or not. We know who we are. It's so easy just to be invisible. And I think that what the prom is helping to do is just to make all of those kids visible. This is the prom I never went to. I was never in the party. And tonight I am. feel they have to keep up some sort of pretense. But why should they? <laughs>